Travis. Forgive your big brother who's too much of a shite bag to thank you face to face. You're the big brother? <laughs> You're How did you know I didn't pop out, out which first? Which one of us popped out first? And the point is, there's no honor in getting rescued by my younger, big <sighs> brother. So I took it upon myself to proper kill Scott Gardner, Greg Cantrell, and Massimo Bellini. You've got to so be kidding me. Would you fifth. fucking people and stop no stealing my me. kills? This makes us even, as far as the rescue goes. You and I still have a score to box off, but that's another subject entirely. So don't get yourself killed till we have a chance to finish our fight. Damn it, Irish ass. He could at least have told me more about those assassins. And in case you were wondering, oh, I took pictures of the three Skangers as souvenirs. How long is this You'll message? Just have to drool over them, because there's no way you can play through these fights. The game's stuffed full as it is. Picks came out nice, though. They'd probably make good wallpaper for your cell. Well, I'm out of things to say, so I'll hang up now. Hm. Long message, isn't it? Hello? Travis, it's me. I have arranged the next fight. Come to my office. Gotcha. Take a seat. There's something I want to talk to you about. Another rule change? No, it's about Henry. I want to clear the air. Why? We are divorced now, you know. What's that got to do with me? I don't want to hear any of that shit. The last time when you and Henry fought each other? Yeah, I remember. You stopped us instead of letting us settle things for good, like men. But you don't know why I stopped you. I did not want you to have to kill your brother. Or die yourself. What the hell does that mean? You told me a killer wins by killing. Now you say you want us both to live. Make up your damn mind. They're our fights. And we know how to end them a lot better than some bitch in the box stand. Telling me not to kill. How many personalities do you have? <laughs> So what? You want revenge, right? Your opponents could not care less about that. Once I'm number one, these bullshit ranking fights are over. Got it? Assassins aren't tools. As fucked up as we might be, we're humans too. Get your ass 
come with me! Die! Oh, 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 you're a joke!
She was called the goddess of death. With sickle in hand, she would chant her requiem. If you heard it, odds were you'd just drawn your last breath. The mere sound of her voice would put ice in your veins. I know. I heard it myself once, from a hundred yards away. The moment it touched my ear, I passed out for an entire week. If I'd heard it up close, I can scarcely imagine. Forget it. Let's talk about happier things.
know this song? Nope. How tragic. Then let me teach you. How beautiful it is.
as hell. Did you... Did you memorize the song? 100%. That... is so... sublime. Three to go. Huh! <laughs> 
Santa Destroy is a magnet for the bizarre. There are things I still don't understand. It is a melting pot. Not only of cultures and people, but even space and time. Did the hero survive? If you know, could you tell me?
You've got to be... Mayday, Mayday, Mayday! Spaceship Volk to Mother! Do you copy? Please respond! Spaceship Volk to Mother! Looks like... I've been followed by an American? This is Captain Vladimir, entering emergency attack mode. Requesting backup for Volk. Transmitting present coordinates now. I gotta fight a whole fucking space program now? Attack unsuccessful. Reacquire target and eliminate enemy. Entering next level of battle mode.
It's over, Captain. This... this is Earth? Yeah. Welcome home. So... I'm finally back. After all this time... Fresh oxygen. Blue sky. Beautiful as I remember. Glory to the Soviet Union.
You are now ranked third. Just leave him alone. Let him rest in peace. We must dispose of the remains. It's policy. Screw your policy. He's back with the Earth after who knows how long. You're not gonna suck him up with your damn vacuum.